Hi, how are you? This is Zita, your guiding luminary. Thank you for joining me today. If this is your first time, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. It's so nice to have you. I'm a life coach and I am also an intuitive. I use oracle cards and crystals to help my clients uncover some deep soul issues to help them unblock them, process them, and to move forward in life. And I also use crystals to help them with their healing process. Today, I wanted to do something light and fun, and uh, I decided to do a yes and no and perhaps something better kind of reading. So for you, I have put out three cards, pile number one, pile number two, and pile number three. And underneath, there's a yes, no, or something better. So what I'm going to invite you to do is to close your eyes and take, take a deep breath and focus on the question, the issue, the situation, or the person you're considering in this reading and ask yourself a question and then pick one of the piles. So without further ado, here we go. There's something better. So this is not a negative thing. Just because you may not get what you want right now at this point in time, doesn't mean it's not gonna materialize in the future. It doesn't mean that this person you're looking to, to perhaps have a relationship with or to get a job or um, start your own business or go back to school. Maybe what you're considering and applying for or pursuing is not right for you at this moment in time. There may be this person you're eyeing and they're not ready. Maybe they have other issues to do. So if you are to approach somebody and they, they don't respond to your invitations to perhaps see each other, it may have nothing to do with you or that person is really maybe not interested in you. So then perhaps there's a better person coming into your life in the, in the near future. The same thing would apply with your job. If you're applying for a great new position and it's in the company you're already in, you had the interview or you didn't even get asked to be interviewed, don't despair. Chances are you didn't have what they were looking for, and that's not a bad thing. You probably wouldn't have been happy in that position anyways. But, you know, go ahead, apply, go through the interview process, and, you know, be professional. If you're not accepted in the position, always thank them for taking their time to interview you and that you're open to other suggestions and opportunities within the company. And this will show tremendous professionalism, and they will consider you for any new positions coming forward. The same thing if you're trying to start a business and you made a job, sorry, uh, you made an offer to purchase a business and it didn't work out to your interest, probably not the right business for you or just not the right time. So don't despair, step back, reevaluate what you're looking to do, who you're trying to meet and see why things are not going as you would like them. Doesn't mean that it's a bad thing, it's just not the right time. So now I'll turn up over the two cards and I just want you to consider that even though you don't get the answer you want. So if you're looking to ask someone out and you'd like them to say yes, if they say no, that doesn't mean it's a bad thing. It's just maybe that person is not ready to be in a relationship or perhaps you are just not matched and it's not the right person for you. So don't despair. There's a million fish in the sea. You'll meet someone new. Okay, so without further ado, I'm gonna turn the next two cards out, over. So yes and no. So I hope you got your answer. And if you did ask for a yes response and you got it, you've got the whole world in front of you. You've got the sun and the moon, the, all the energy radiating, radiating outward. So I really hope you're happy by getting the yes. So if you're looking to ask somebody out, this person will say yes. If you're considering get, getting this job, this position, or trying to start a business or going back to school, you will be accepted. You'll get that promotion. So you're going to be really excited. And if the answer came out to be no, look deeply within. As you can see, this person is considering the options. This person is sitting on the seashore and looking at the, at the angel. And having a no is not necessarily a bad thing. You may have been going through a difficult time with your health. So you had to go through a whole bunch of tests and in the end, everything's fine. They found nothing. So having a no is a fantastic answer. So I hope this reading resonated with you and you got your answer. If you liked it, 
please like and subscribe to my channel. And if you'd like a personal reading, feel free to reach out to me. My information is in the description below. Thank you and have a great day.